Step into your trust fund, of course. No bother at all. Passes in the phone. I just need to ring the bank. <gasps> Seven six five four three two one. That's the account number and the password. What is it again? Oh, was it now? Oh, oh why? Catch your cell phone. Dad, for God's sake, will you turn that down? I have turned it down. It's at zero. You will have an opportunity then. I don't even know how he does it. Are you telling me I don't have a trust fund? There you go. You're not as slow as you look. Do I have a trust fund, Mary? Listen, girls, there are no trust funds. There are no funds, period. For God's sake! OK, that's one portion of redfish, one portion of whitefish, two bags of chips. No, no, no. Two bags won't be enough. Two's plenty, Joe. Four. Four should cover us. Three, then. We'll compromise. I'll compromise you through that window. That's enough, dear. The tight bastard's trying to starve us all, Mary. OK. Four bags of chips, then. And I want 12 chicken nuggets, a small battered oh. hot dog, plenty of onions, plenty of... Get a move on, Daddy. Is that chippy? Well, it's every man for himself on a Friday night. I am trying to concentrate here, Erin. All right, Mommy. All right, love. Did you ask about the trust fund? I, I don't have one. I'll take it, that means I don't have one. For the love of God. Will four bags be enough? More than enough. I say we'd need five to be safe. Do you not think, Dad? Stick down, Faith. <sighs> Five bags of chips, then. I'll have a chicken fillet burger. No lettuce, no tomato, no cheese. I'll just write plain, will I? No onions, no cucumber. One plain. No relish, no pickles, no mayonnaise. No chicken. What do you mean, no chicken? Get that. <sighs> it's a chicken burger. Of course I want chicken. What are you? A simpleton? Oh. No chicken. It's Uncle Colin. Well, I'm not taking it. I've been stung once already this week. An hour and 45 minutes talking about his new shoelaces. I'm sure I've stopped answering my phone altogether for fear it's him, Mary. Will you take it, Dad? No chance, love. I mean, I know I shouldn't say this about my own brother, but by Christ, he's a boring bastard. Well, is somebody going to take it or not? Don't you but take it. This is the cheek, you. How's it going, Colm? Would you ever think of going cordless? I was brave and cold earlier, that's true. Jenna Sharkey went cordless and she's like a new woman now, Jerry. No, it's not as cold now. She can make a call from her living room, from her kitchen, from her bedroom. Right, look, Colm, I don't have long. We're sitting to the chippy here. And the other night, right, and this is no word of a lie, she rang me from the bath. These cordless phones of the future. What? Oh, my God! What's wrong? Our Colm's in the police station. Last night, two gunmen forced their way into his house, tied him up, stole his van. Dirty bastards. Oh, God, love you, you poor critter. You ought to come straight round here, do you hear me? Oh, of course, of course. Is he all right? He is traumatised, Jerry. He'll take his dick and kidney pie. Do you think five bags will be enough? 